This wonderful chart from Timkin, which you'll find in quite a few workshops, will show you the type of faults that can happen to bearings. This is downloadable from the Timkin site, link is below in the description of the video. This is what your wheel bearings could look like on your Land Rover, and thanks to Rob Dickerson of Facebook for this picture. These are the wheel bearings he found in one of his hubs. More commonly, your bearing race, which is a bearing track, will look like this. And according to the Gospel of Timkin, the bearing race has suffered bruising, which could be debris or bits and pieces that have been in the grease and dented the race. This you might well see if your wheel bearings have been loose for a while. Excessive end play, this is scalloping. In the video description, there will be links to PDFs from Timkin. We all know that Timkin are a very good maker of wheel bearing and they're reliable, but they're only as reliable as the person who fits it and the conditions it works in. There's um, One of the PDFs is quite detailed. If you're into that sort of thing, it's a very good read. Bearings are used on quite a few components on the vehicle and if you find yourself to be an expert on identifying what the problems are, then you're winning when it comes to diagnosis and repairing certain units. So this is a good resource for Land Rover owners and those who want to expand into the trade. Next couple of minutes you're going to have a look at some of the defects to music and if you're interested you can stop and quickly read.